It was an historic morning in the quest for commercial space travel. Jeff Bezos' Blue Origin rocket lifting off into the atmosphere and successfully returning to Earth. The entire trip taking around 10 minutes and the history-making crew on board fulfilled several dreams along the way. CBS News' Skylar Henry has more. Engine start. Two, one. Blue Origin founder Jeff Bezos and his team made history this morning, blasting off to outer space. The first human passengers on his company's fully automated rocket. I felt peaceful and serene and calm. Surprisingly uh, natural. Surprisingly natural. Yeah. The, cap the Amazon founder was accompanied by his brother Mark, 82-year-old aviation trailblazer Wally Funk, and an 18-year-old Dutch student. Funk, who trained with the Mercury astronauts in the 60s, and Dutch teenager Oliver Damon are now the oldest and youngest people ever to fly in space. During the approximately 10-minute trip, they experienced majestic views and several minutes of weightlessness before returning to Earth. We set out to create the safest human spaceflight vehicle ever designed or, or built or operated. Bezos's space flight comes on the heels of fellow billionaire Richard Branson's launch earlier this month, ushering in a new era of commercial space travel. These are not inexpensive flights. Only very rich people or governments are going to be able to put people on board for a long time. So the question is, can they sustain this as a new marketplace uh, and keep it going long enough for economies of scale to kick in and prices to come down? After a smooth landing, the excited and jubilant crew celebrated on solid ground. Bezos wants Blue Origin to go to the moon and ultimately colonize the cosmos. Today was just the first step. Skyler Henry, CBS News.